Hello, 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 hello. How are you guys doing? Thank you guys so much for joining Tierra's Tarot. I appreciate you guys clicking onto my video. This video will be for all my beautiful and my handsome Virgos out there. How y'all doing? How y'all doing? Keep in mind that this is a gentle reading so it's not going to resonate with everyone so please take the parts that does resonate and what does it leave it all out also this could be the past the present or in the future and to be aware of any scammers in the comments that you're pretending to be a girl okay so let's go ahead and get started here so some of you you could be feeling the emotions of somebody else at this time okay is what i'm getting here oh yeah you could be feeling the emotions of somebody because somebody continues to get readings on you here is what I'm getting here. There's somebody that keep pulling cards on you here. Somebody wants to know about your finances. Um, what is this? So this is the nine of pentacles in this card here. Okay, if y'all can see that card on the table, somebody is pulling cards on you or getting uh, readings done on you from a... Um, a Pacific practitioner or a tarot card reader or something like that here, Virgo, within this next week. This could have already been going on for some of y'all or this is about to happen, okay? Is what I'm getting here. So somebody is taking upon themselves to go to a practitioner to get a reading done on you, okay? And this practitioner is telling this person that you are in the Nine of Pentacles energy, okay? Very independent, okay? Doing your thing out here, investing in yourself at this time. And some of y'all, they told this person the truth about your feelings towards this individual. And for some of y'all, this tarot card reader told them that they no longer want you know, that you no longer want to deal with them is what I'm getting here, okay? That you don't feel the same way and you do not care about them the way that you used to, okay? If anything, you just focusing on yourself, okay? Some of y'all, like I said, with Nine of Pentacles, that could signify that you are single. Some of you, there is a new partner here on the table, okay, is what I'm getting here. But somebody could have also said something about that, okay? Even though that she, just, she could have said, yeah, he or she is out here dating, you know, just doing it, focusing on themselves is what I'm getting. And now it really triggered this person to the point where this person is like, man, I need help. It says, let me get help. Oh, wow. So this person like, wow, I need help now because now they know the truth that you no longer want to deal with them. Hold on, y'all. Oh, yeah. Somebody mad. Okay. Because they, I'm coughing and shit for no reason. So for some of y'all, Virgo, this person here, okay, it's like they getting choked up about what they're hearing, okay, is what I'm getting, what this tarot card reader is telling them, they're getting choked the fuck up, okay, now this person is spilling the emotions on a, a really intense level. Okay, and now they're wishing that they would have treated you better is what I'm getting. So some of you need to continue to cleanse your space, light your sage, okay, your candles or what have you, for your white candles for protection. Um, Some of you need to put salt around your home, the corners of your home or something like that here, Virgo, okay, because there is somebody definitely in your energy, okay, sending you negative energy. Well, <coughs> mm, I wouldn't just say negative energy. But like the press sad and you know what have you energy. Yeah, because we got here bad news. Wow. So yeah, so somebody's getting a reading done and they're hearing this is bad news to them. Yeah, this person could have even got a phone reading. What do you call that? Somebody could have literally called someone and asked somebody, like, I see this person walking somewhere or, you know, uh, running errands or something like that, and they call somebody maybe that they know or this is a practitioner that they go to on a regular is what I'm getting here. Okay, and um, yeah, they had a phone conversation or what have you with this individual, okay, when it comes to you. Now this person is depressed, y'all. Whoever this individual is, they feel like a fucking jackass. They feel like a clown is what I'm getting here. Yeah, because somebody here was being real sneaky with another individual, okay? Whoever this individual was, they they was they was throwing rocks and hiding their hand is what I'm getting as well. So they also got people here to team up against you to, you know, get people to isolate or, you know, isolate you or get just like in general to get people to get away from you is what I'm getting is what I'm getting here. So there was a couple of people here that was involved in this as well. Okay, Virgo, because of the simple fact that you're in this Queen of Pentacles energy. Like I said, somebody was really trying to know what, what you had going on with your finances and who you were dating and investing, investing in at this time. 
time, okay? Whoever this individual is, they have been being watched in higher places as well. For some of y'all, that could be in the spiritual realm, okay? And if your spirit guides are saying that they gave this person too many chances to make it right with you, doesn't mean that they had to be with you, but they had to, you know, really repent, okay, right their wrongs and apologize, even though some of you don't care about apology, but they still have many chances here to right their wrongs in the situation, okay? So now your spirit guides of the most high here is, is serving this person instant karma at this time, okay? This person, because we got here a letter, this person is not able to reach you. So for some of y'all, this person could definitely be, um, I don't know, they couldn't be locked up for some of y'all. This person could even be trying to send you letters, okay, is what I'm getting here from jail or prison or something like that. That's for some of y'all with the Ten of Swords. Yeah, somebody could definitely be getting locked up or is already locked up. But they know that there will not be a new beginning between the two of y'all. And it's cutting them real deep at this time. It's cutting them deep, y'all. They're really, they're really feeling this emotion, okay, at this time. For some of y'all, this person still dreams of you. They still, they still see you in their dreams when they close their eyes at night. For some of y'all, okay. And it's like this person is really jealous. Maybe they, they even could have gotten a, um, I don't know, could have seen your partner in their dreams or something of that nature, okay. Or they just somehow know about this new partner. This could be from this tarot card reader that they've been going to for a while, whoever this person is, okay. For some of y'all, okay. That's what I'm getting. What else, spirit? Yeah, we have here the four of wands and the devil. Wow. So this person is definitely obsessed with material things. That's the truth with the ace of swords, okay? This person was chasing money. At the time, maybe you didn't have money or something like that, or they thought that they was getting with somebody here that had more than you, okay? They thought that they was they was able to deal with somebody that could be a stepping stone from them, okay? But, this, but somehow this person knew that they can do that with you, or it's like at the time you didn't have it like that is what I'm getting. Okay, but this person is obsessed with material assets, material things. Okay, the material world is what I'm getting here. And it's like God had to really humble this individual. Okay, because it's not about material shit is what I'm getting here. It's about the heart, okay? Yeah, we got here, ooh, yeah, death to the freaking um, ace of wands here. So for some of y'all... Like, you no longer are attracted to this person, and this person knows that. For others of y'all, if you were starting a new project or something of that nature, this person was trying to end that for you. They could have been trying to end your stability with the four wands and the devil card is what I'm getting here. So somebody was also jealous of what you created. But guess what? We have here justice here. Yeah, the, period. You get a victory, baby. Justice and a victory. Libra energy, Scorpio energy, Capricorn energy is what we have here on the table. Yeah, we got the six of pentacles. So, yeah, something will be given back to you is what i'm getting here okay any type of delays or setbacks that you had experienced in your life is coming back around to you okay is what i'm getting because like i said this person is being watched in higher places and they're about to be humbled okay is what i'm getting maybe this person even owe y'all some money for some of y'all yeah we got the full card we got the full card Aries energy here. Yeah, you're going to be definitely taking a risk here, okay, after some type of enlightenment or confirmation, okay, is what I'm getting. Yeah, two of pentacles. Some of y'all are going to take a risk, maybe do something spontaneously with your kids. Maybe some of you are going to, do, you're deciding to move away or something of that nature with your children or something like that. Or maybe just going to be doing something with kids, okay, is what I'm getting here. Yeah, but once they're gonna nine of pentacles, okay? Yeah, some of you are definitely about to experience some type of, you know, wealth and happier days in your life is what I'm getting, Virgo, okay? Because somebody here, it's like they're trying to disrupt you. They still try to disrupt you is what I'm getting. Yeah, somebody's trying to slow something up with the three of swords and the four of swords, I mean the four of cups, because somebody here is dissatisfied in their own life, okay? And so they're trying to attack you is what I'm getting here with the nine of uh, swords here. Yeah, this person wants you to be like this. They want you to be feeling unsatisfied in your work or something of that nature is what I'm getting here. But your work and your, your hard work and your dedication is what's, what's going to, you know, get you far here. This person doesn't, they don't finish anything that they start is what I'm getting here. What this person likes to do is target people here that have something going on for themselves and take them down. Because whoever this person tried to leave you for, okay, with this Three of Cups energy, it's like, they sucked the life out of this individual. They took everything that this person had, okay? 
it's what I'm getting. And at the time, you didn't have anything, okay, for this person to take, or you was smart as fuck, and you did not allow this person, you didn't tell this person what, how much money you was making, or your next moves, or plans, or anything of that nature, okay? Some of you escaped in silence, period. Okay, for some of y'all, is what I'm getting here. Yeah, and so now this person want to spin the block and take you for what you have now because you're on top is what I'm getting. Mm -mm. Hell nah, Virgo. Hell nah. Okay, we got here the Eight of Swords. See, this person is playing victim. Okay, is what I'm getting here. They're playing victim now. Okay? They swear, but that, oh, did they even going to try to blame this, this third party and say that this third party did this to them, but really they're fucking narcissists? Yeah, world card. This shit is coming to an end. Nobody's going for that shit. Okay, some of you, yeah, somebody here also tried to overburden your relationship, okay, with the Ten of Cups and the Ten of Wands and the Two of Cups. Somebody definitely tried to overburden. It's like make your, your relationship even harder, okay, is what I'm getting here, to get something off of the ground. Like, somebody here was really targeting you, whoever this individual is, okay, yeah. Yeah, we got the moon card, yeah, but they didn't want you to know this here. Yeah, five of swords, but they was keeping an eye on you. Like I said, somebody here was definitely, uh, all up in your business, through tarot cards, you know, read-ins, and, you know, just watching you on, I don't know, social media or what have you. But they was doing something up in the moon cycle, the moon phases here, is what I'm getting. Yeah. Mm. What else, spirit? This is, uh. Okay, what is that? Hold on, y'all. Damn. Okay, so we got here secret account. Yeah, so somebody was definitely looking you up on some type of a secret account is what I'm getting here. Yeah, whoever this person is that was off and on in your life here, okay, whoever ghosted you here. Yeah, so they're looking up, they're looking up your, um, your social media through secret accounts is what I'm getting, but like you didn't already know that though, Virgo. Okay, yeah, we got here Firestorm, but this person is going through karma for trying to create drama in your life, endings in your life. Okay, yeah, this person is definitely going through some type of a mental breakdown. I can't make it up. Okay, yeah, karmic ties, all right? And, uh, and also because of who they decided to associate themselves with, okay? Yeah, we got here Illumination, so the truth, discovery, and awakening, but the truth is coming out, okay? Now this person is feeling isolated, rejected, okay, because nobody's falling for this person's lies against you or anything of that nature, Okay, so yeah, somebody's getting their karma back this week is what I'm getting straight up. Okay, they can be jealous of your new love, your new endeavors, your new projects, all they want to here, honey. All right, because I'm getting that your your spirit guys are definitely humbling this person for trying to throw, you know, rocks at you and hide their hands. Nah. Okay, so somebody finally getting exposed. Okay, this person has been being watched, uh, uh, you know, for a long time. And it's like... You know, spirit tried to give this person many chances, but they still was ignorant and arrogant and did not want to, you know, face their, you know, wrongs and look at their shadow side. So, hey, they getting karma this week. Some of you may hear this. If you don't, just know that this is what's going on. Okay, period. But I'm going to go ahead and end it right there, Virgos. I love you guys so freaking much. I need anything else from me. Look in the description box below. If you guys want to check out more of my content, go check out my TikTok account. I love you guys. I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.